All right. Hey, guys. Um, first things first, let's just see who's going home. Now, if you guys follow me on Twitter, you'll have seen my poll that I did, and you'll see the results from that. And if you don't follow me on Twitter, the results of the girls who are being sent home from each group were Shawnee, Tammy, and Mylan. Um, there wasn't a fourth girl because Mylan was, in, was just grouped by herself since it was an odd number. So it was between those three. So I took those three girls into a Discord server that I am a part of. Um, one of the admins let me use their girls in this contest. So huge shout out to them again. Um, the Discord will be mentioned in the com in the description again, as it was in the last video. I'm pretty sure. So I took voting to them and I asked them, you know, out of these three girls, who would you want to stay and who would you want to go home? And to them, it came down between Shawnee and Mylan. And I am now here to tell you which of these girls is going to be sent home. I don't know if you remember me saying this last time, since it's been a while, but I don't do... I've never seen Next Top Model, truthfully. I've just liked the concept of doing it in Sims. So my version of getting them sent home may be a little bit different from the traditional ways. Just a little bit. But without further suspense, here is who will be going home. That's right, guys. It was Shawnee who got sent home. I told you this wasn't the traditional way for Sims to get voted off. Uh... Uh, ignore her laughing in the background. She's she's a very good person. Idol definitely wouldn't laugh at somebody dying like that. Ali, stop! You're gonna blow your cover. Jesus. But <clears throat> poor Shawnee got voted off, and of course it'd be embarrassing being the first person voted off. So she died of embarrassment after wetting herself. Sometimes you just can't hold your bladder. You know, I get it. But we're um. We're just not going to wait for her to die. We don't really care that much. We're just going to go home. Go home. Why can I not go home? Okay, so we faced an issue. Can I not go home because she's dying? Is that the thing? I think that's actually the thing. Okay. Well, uh, yeah, that's fine. We'll just walk away from this. Please reap her faster. There we go. Now we're Ooh. Collect the urn. We're going to make a graveyard. Probably not a thing I should save that happily. But we're going to make a graveyard. I'm excited. <laughs> it's going to be the best looking graveyard it is full of models. Alright guys, we're back at the house. The mansion. I think it's only fair that we let Mylan know that she almost got voted off. Give her a little fair warning. She's been taking it pretty well though, so that's good at least. Now we're going to be doing another competition uh, later on in the sim day. For now, I'm just kind of going to let the house run to see if any of them interact with each other. Um, I think after this episode, I'm going to start adjusting the relationships manually. So that way we can hopefully stir up some drama. If you know nothing happens after that, I'll just have to start doing it manually. I just want to see how they interact with each other on their own, though. So, I first off want to apologize for... Oh, God, it's lagging again. Okay. <sighs> Great. I but you know, first off, I want to apologize for how long it's been since I last updated the series. Um, I want to explain what happened. So when I first recorded this, I was living in my apartment alone. I didn't have a job. I was in a relationship. I was, you know, also recording a bunch of other videos. Um, I had full intention of... I'm sorry, who got a twerk skill? That's fantastic. Her thing is not loading. Okay, well... Glad to know that my CC is broken. Oh no, there it is. Now it loads. But I do just want to... Okay, so 
that that's where I was um, when I recorded that video. Um, I think it was the day before I went to go record the next episode. Um, I got a phone call from my boyfriend and he broke up with me. And it just hit me really hard. So I didn't really know what to do. I, I was just heartbroken about it. And, you know, it, it yeah, I, I was just heartbroken about it. And the thing is, is that me being in Texas, I, wait, Pearl has a job? What? You know what? <sighs> Whatever. Why are they all cooking? Is my question. We literally have a butler for this exact reason. They don't have to. There's a fire. <gasps> what? What? Who? Where? Why? It didn't notify me, did it? Huh? Oh. Uh, who else was cooking? She was cooking, right? What? Oh, the fire hasn't started yet. They're preemptively extinguishing the fire. <laughs> um, oh my god! <gasps> What's happening? Oh my god. <laughs> Guys, so much is happening. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Oh, there's the fire. <laughs> oh my god, this game is lacking so much. The fire burned before. <gasps> Y'all, this is exactly why we hired a butler in the first place. So this stuff could be avoided. You know, I just, <sighs> all right, well, I am proud of her for creating a fire. I guess that takes talent. <sighs> Back to what I was saying though. I, um, I got dumped and I was just really devastated about it and, you know, he was the only reason I was staying in Texas. So I called up my mom literally like right after we hung up and I told her what happened. I told her, hey, you know, I he just broke up with me. I want to come home. So she hung up the phone, said she'd call me back in a little bit. Where did I hear... Oh, they're all outside freaking out because of the fire still? Can they not? Like, wait. I can't I can't switch who I'm playing. Oh, okay, there we go. Yeah, can they stop overreacting? Like, seriously. It's not that big of a deal. It was just a tiny little fire. I mean, have these people never, you know seen a fire before? Have they never been in a fire? I've been in a fire. I was totally fine. Well, yeah, I was totally fine. I only panicked a little bit because, you know, I was one who started it. But, uh, she called me a little bit later and she said, look, I just, she, look, I just called off work. We are going to come and get you right now. And I am so thankful that my family was this, er, like, so ready and able to help me. And they came that, they left 3 a.m. that night and got there the next day. Um, the day after that, we started packing up everything and loaded up the U-Haul and moved me back. Um... You know, this was a while ago. This is about a week ago that I finally got back. When I finally got back home. And it, it was hard at first being back. I mean, it was good being back here, but it was hard. Just trying to adjust to everything. And we've been trying to get all of the furniture put away. And trying to get un everything unpacked. And I still have almost nothing unpacked. I just got my furniture today because we had to order brand new furniture. And 
I've just been spending a lot of time with my family and my friends trying to, you know, cope with everything. And, you know, I realize that they're not doing anything. This is probably boring for you guys if you're just... What is she doing now? Are, are y'all... What are they doing? Are they really just standing in a circle doing, like... Nothing? Why do they keep seeing what's happening? Sorry, I keep getting attracted from the story, but I'm trying to figure out why they're all just standing there doing absolutely nothing. Like, I have their free will sit as hot sat. Oh my god, I can't talk. Set as high as it can go. So I understand why they wouldn't be doing something. Probably because the fire happened. Now they're all scared to go back inside, which, you know, makes sense. But. Yeah. Um. All that happened, and I was just trying to, you know, get myself better and in a better mind state and place. So, I, I do apologize for how long it's been. It's just been a series of events that happened, and the videos that have been getting uploaded, even though I think it's only been, like, two since, a few since then, um, those were all recorded a long time ago. And I just finally, the other day, sat down and edited them and got them ready to be uploaded. So I'm sorry for making you guys waiting. I af After this, I hopefully should be able to get back on schedule. It's just, it's still kind of hard for me, so I'm just adjusting still. So it's it may be a little off and on for a while still, just until I can get into a better mind state. But I it shouldn't be this big of a gap again between the series, so I do apologize. But I've been talking long enough. They are now just all standing outside, not doing any, or now just two of them are, but they're not really doing much anymore since the fire happened. So let's make her come back from work. Cause I don't even know why she's at work in the first place. Make her come back. Yes, you should leave. She's trying to be a model. What is more important, being a model or being a assistant dishwasher? I think that one's probably more important, if I'm being honest. You have way more chance of success than that one, you know? And I would, I would choose that one. You're not, you're not even the main dishwasher. You're just the assistant. Oh. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and get them ready for the next competition. And... Now, truthfully, I haven't even gotten so far as to have Sims Bladder fail in a lot. Who Splatter fail? Who beat them? Oh, my God. Was it her? It was her. Ah. Oh. Why, Yui? Why are you like this? Oh, my God. Yep. There it is. Now, now, this is how Shawnee dies. I don't know if you're trying to get yourself voted off now or, like, what. But I'm just telling you, this is how she got voted off, so you're kind of leading yourself up there. <laughs> but I will see what the next competition is going to be, honestly, because I, I don't know what the next competition is yet. I've, I'm recording. I don't even know. I don't even know what it's going to be. <sighs> well, let's see what I decide. So I'm going to be honest with you guys really quick. I, uh... I messed up. But you may notice that it's now suddenly earlier in the day, and um, we have more money than we did before, and also Pearl is at work again. Well, that is because I accidentally deleted half the household. Ha <laughs> ha! So I had to um relaunch the game to get them all back. But don't worry, I, I still killed Shawnee the same way. She's still- oh, now she's twerking. Oh, I like the other save better. But I Shawnee is still gone. I just I'm very disappointed in myself that I I really I just sat there and I was like, oh I need I'm gonna change one of Alia's outfits really quick. And I click the mirror to like plan outfit and then as it was loading I was like, wait a second. I this is gonna delete half the household, it is isn't it? I backed out of it and sure enough there went half the household, just gone. So, 
Yeah, that's my bad, guys. But it's all fixed now. All right, y'all. Oh, she walked away as soon as I hit play. That figures. Well, our next one is going to be sleepover. I was going to do something else, but when I did that one, I realized that I never set her outfit for it, and I currently cannot go and edit outfits right now because when I do, it deletes half the household, and I don't know how to work MC Command Center and only edit one person. So we have it split into two groups again. We already have our first group from last time here. Um, we just stayed at the house because, you know, you're going to have sleepover at home. You're not really going to go out for that. Oh, there's a door there. So we have Yui right here. Pulling off your Bob Pancakes look. And then... Oh, it's just so laggy. We have Serenity here pulling off your... What I'm going to call the typical... You know how they have the typical hot guy cooking breakfast for you? Where he's sitting there all, you know, six pack and all shirtless cooking eggs for breakfast. Well, I'm saying she's pulling off the female look of that right now. Then we have Pearl, who I cannot see. Pulling off a nice boy look, which I really appreciate. We have, why is she... <sighs> And we have Aspen here. I don't even know what she's doing, honestly. I'm... <sighs> she's being Aspen. We have Rosalind, whose outfit I forgot to edit. And I can't edit, so... Oops. And then we have beautiful Tammy, who's probably rocking the most model-esque sleep look right now, if I'm being honest. So I'm not going to... Wait, did one of these girls come home? Okay, no, they didn't. Whew. I, I only have... I have all the other girls right now just off on a random lot. So at any point in time, they could easily just come back. And I'm just kind of hoping they don't. Now, there's not really much that we're going to be able to see here just because they're... See, look, she already changed back into her... <sighs> okay. Well, I guess the point is is that you did see her sleepwear outfit for a little bit before she decided to change. But it looks like we have... Oh, God. We have Alia chatting it up with Serenity right now. And Pearl's trying to get in on it, even though she's not even dressed appropriately for this event. <gasps> you heard that, right? She said, uh-uh. She's mad. She, know she knows that Pearl messed up. I think that was Serenity who said it. Already, there's gonna be a feud between the two of them. If they both make it to the next episode, there's gonna be a feud. I'm already telling, I'm already calling it right now. But because I'm running very close on time, I'm going to go ahead and not really let them interact that much more. I'm just going to go ahead and call the next group over. Okay, so the other girls have finally arrived. It took a while because of how slow the game is running. But we're going to run through them really quick. Again, I don't really have... I'm running out of time, so we're just going to look at them really quick. Maybe let them interact a little bit, and then we'll call it quits. So, right here we have Bria. And I have never seen this CC before for a sleep. I love it. Like, I love it. I think that is probably the best look for sleepwear. Or for a sleepover. And then we have Tana here. All right. She's rocking hers as well. I love it. Yeezus? Okay. That. <sighs> really? Yeezus? Oh, they're all be late for the bathroom. Okay. I cannot let this play. Um, Yumiko is running late. I don't know why, but she was the slowest one to get here. So we gotta wait a while before I can show you her. And we have Mylan here. Was rocking a more sexier Bob Pancakes look. We have Lauren, who's just going almost all natural, but not quite. Still, I do love, I love Mylans. I love, I, I love all of this groups. Again, this, 
This group just rocks for mo model wise, probably because the other group contains most of my sims, and my sims were not made for this competition. They were made for other reasons. Like Shawnee, the one who was uh, eliminated. I use that term lightly. At the beginning of this episode, I made for the Island Living expansion pack. So, not really made for this. But, stop rambling. Okay, next we have Shannon, which I love this as well. Like, this one's more like an athletic, or yeah, an athletic sleepover where I love it. And then we have Nicolite, who's, ooh, she's wearing almost the same, she's wearing the exact same thing as Mylan, just she's wearing high heels. Hers is sexier. Ooh, and look at that. Oh, she is pulling that off. She knows she's got this. All right, well, let's wait a second for Yumiko to decide to show up. Oh, was that her walking in, actually? No, no, it was not. She is still coming. Well, I guess while we wait, we'll go ahead and let them enter. Where are they all going? Like, genuinely, where are they all going? Are they going towards her? That seems to be a general theme here, is they all go towards her. <gasps> I didn't know Tana's hair is in a ponytail. I love it. Alright, Yumiko decided to join us. Yay! And here is Yumiko's sleepover outfit for the competition. Now, I don't... I'm not sure how I want to describe this. Like, I have... I, I know how I want to describe it, like... In what term, but I, I can't like put a word to it. But that is all of our show. For, this is all for the next top model episode. Oh, coming over. She really just kind of coming to eat chicken nuggets in Yumiko's face. Is, is that really all that's happening right now? Okay, yeah, that's all that happened. All right. Well, that's a great way to end this. Start with a disaster, end with disaster. Well, thank y'all for watching. I will again be putting the poll up for who should be voted off on my Twitter page again. So it, I will have that linked into the description. Please follow, subscribe, follow Twitter, subscribe to my YouTube, like this video, share it with your friends. Um, really, um, support does help me a lot, even though you know I only have seven subscribers. I, I'm not really getting paid for this, but just the support helps me keep making these videos. Thank y'all for watching. And oh, she's peeing. Thank y'all for watching. And I look forward to seeing who's getting eliminated next. <laughs> right. Bye, guys.